a lot of people see you working out as, you know, maybe I'll get healthier. Maybe I'll uh, build my body into more of a, a physique with more prowess that uh, maybe attracts more mates or whatever, whatever your goal is for working out. People often ignore the compounding benefits of working out. So working out typically is seen as a, a unidimensional habit, whereas I work out to get X. I work out to be healthier. I work out because I have a heart problem, because I have diabetes. I work out because I want to be slightly healthier. I want to look better. I want to not have as much acne or whatever, whatever your reason is. People don't realize when you start to work out, you pay attention to a lot more. You pay attention to your sleep schedule because you need more sleep to recover when you work out. You pay attention to your your healthy eating because if you're gonna spend all this time working super hard, you're gonna commit to four days to seven days a week in the gym, you're probably gonna wanna eat healthy because otherwise you're just throwing like half of your gains or more down the down the chute for no good reason. And sleeping too, that's it throws your gains away if you don't sleep well. Um, you might want to cut out a lot of your alcohol consumption. People that work out typically are on the heavy drinker scale. They're not they're not prone to be light drinkers. Light drinkers are uh, typically people that don't work out. Um, and I think a lot of that comes down to the intensity that comes from the kind of person that works out, a kind of person that is able to remain consistent, to build momentum, to go work out all the time, is typically a person that has that intensity and momentum and consistency inside themselves, that have that that strong character that is able to carry over into other areas where they can carry over that intensity and that drive into any area. And so when you drink, you know, that competitive nature, that intense nature tends to come out as well. So um as far as cutting out alcohol a lot of them don't but there are that do the period people that are extremely serious you know cut out the alcohol they become serious about multiple habits so you've already become a better eater that's better for your heart maybe a small a, a lesser drinker so that's better for your liver you know so your organs are getting better um a better sleeper that's better for your mind okay so you're you're not only improving you know your biceps you're now improving multiple areas of your life okay so this is a compounding habit it, it it affects more things than just x okay more things than just the one variable you're thinking of okay so um working out translates okay to working hard to intensity okay so think about it like that people think of it like a, a strong body strong mind right yeah that's a good that's a good way to put it but what about a strong body strong mind strong heart strong liver strong stomach because you're eating better um just a strong overall person okay working out makes a stronger person okay so that's my advice to you work out be consistent and strengthen your person be become a person of character become a person that's strong